Hello people, my name is Kuru Swag, and I'm going to be making tutorials in zombies of methods that I found to make things easier for everyone. So um, this, this will be my first video <laughs> too for the tutorials. So my first one is what I think the easiest method for getting the flag is, like the flag step completed. So, I will show you that right now. It's actually very simple. I discovered it uh, last night while I was trying to grind for Xenomatter. And I realized that if you do this, the flag gets done in like a millisecond. Oh shit. But yes. Here. Let me go. First things first, you need to know how to get the flag done. So you're going to have to lift the book. You can pro you probably know what I'm talking about, but if you don't, I'll show you. First you need to lift the book. If you know about this, skip ahead. But uh, yes, it's up here. You go into Nero's room, you do this book on the ground, you hold square on it, starts her axe, and it starts flying up. Then these things spawn at the tables, the gatekeepers. Uh, but yeah, this method is very good. I, I don't think I've seen anyone else talk about this method that I found. So, I'm pretty sure this is the first video about this that has been made. But if I'm wrong, correct me. But yeah. So I don't even need to pack a punch my ray gun really, because you don't do anything. So first what you do, grab the flag. You go over here, go to one of the spots. And if you're playing with four players, I don't know if this works, but but it most likely does. Put the flag down and you run. This is what you do. You just get away from the flag, go to the rift, go anywhere else in the map, but just don't be near the flag. So just stay down here, there will be a bunch of things, so just do the thing with the shoots. Once you're down here, wait a couple minutes, or not minutes, seconds, wait about 30 seconds-ish. That's what I'm doing, wait near for a bit, and then you go back. And once you're back, the flag should be done. So you grab it, and then you go to the next area. Then you put it down, and you run again. Just straight up give her across the map. I usually go into the rift, because that's the best place. And if you're with four people, I'm guessing, because I haven't tried this with four people, I only tried it solo. But you could just rush down here, get everyone down here. Because what I'm thinking is going down is the balls, like the fucking meat things. People call them elements. I don't want to get into technical terms because I find that shit stupid. But, um, yeah. What I think is, since they only spawn near players, but they're supposed to attack the flag. But since they're not close enough to the flag, they target the player. Nothing is targeting the flag right now, and it just takes time to charge. So all it does is it waits to charge up, and then it... Shadow Man doesn't really do anything, he just makes it weaker. And then what you do, oh lord, is you take the flag, and you run back in here. And you could do that for all four flag locations. This method is very, very, very easy. But remember, there is a Margo you have to fight. Max ammo, though. That's always good. <laughs> but yeah, this is, I think, the best method that I've found for completing this. You can get this done, this step done very fast. 
because when I play with friends, this is usually the step that takes the most time if it's not building the swords, because people seem to not know how to cover the flag. But with this, you don't even need to cover the flag. All you need to do is run around and just stay the fuck away from it. Now what I'd recommend if you're doing this with four people and it works, is you get everyone down in the rift, and then after a couple seconds, one guy runs. And uh, he, he goes and moves the flag, and then he comes right back to this spot. Because if you have everyone run, a ton of shit is going to spawn over there. And that is not going to be a good time. So I'll just show you again that it works in every location. Holy shit, there's a lot of things spawning still. I started this on a, uh, a what's it called round. A bonus round, I'll call it. Come on. There we go. So yeah, I'll just show you again. I'll do uh, canals. But the way I, the ma way I managed to find this method was I just just tried to get Xenomatter and it ended up working. So I'll go to canals and I'll show you it works in every location. Then you place it and you run. Gobblegum much these days. They patched it so you can't use Inferial Enhancement with the Wonder Weapon anymore. It sucks. Alright, now the flag should be done. I'm gonna run this way. But all, I, all the Shadow Man does to the flag is weaken it. He, they destroyed it that time because I wasn't quick enough to run back. And they all spawned around it. Which is, that was the problem, the one problem with it. Is if you're not fast enough while arriving there and going back, they will destroy the flag. So what you're going to want to do is try and make it back to the flag as fast as you can. And don't spend too much time in the rift. Well, the Shadow Man will weaken it enough that it only takes one hit from, like, a meatball or a parasite. But yeah, what I'm saying right now is Canals is probably the most difficult one to have done. Because it's so far away from the Rift Portal. Usually going straight into the rift works, but I'm gonna head right back to the flag. And it's done. So that's all you really need to do. At one point you will fail it, like I did earlier, but that's only because you didn't run to it fast enough. So say I run this way, I should probably shoot the Shadow Man or he'll destroy it. Perfect. Okay. All the ones that spawned up there may destroy it or not, which is why you need to run out of there as fast as you can. But now that you're down here, they should stop spawning up there, and they'll just spawn down here. And you can get them all away. Some people say, oh, you need kills to charge the flag. But right now I'll just not kill anything and it'll still charge here, look. It doesn't have enough charge right now because my controller hasn't shaken. Ooh, these parasites are fucking with me. So now I'm going to go back. They might get it because I'm not close enough. Ooh, nope. Then you grab it, and then you go. Let me grab a shield before I do this, though. But yeah, this was my method to getting the flag done very, very, very easily. Instead of having to stand guard and watch over it.
but yeah, I'm a new YouTuber. I'm going to start making videos usually. If you want more of this, I guess, tell me, but probably no one's going to be watching this. <laughs> so, I'll, uh, I'll see you guys later, I guess.